Whew. I am so glad we got a chance to do this again before the weather changed. Yes. <laughs> Girl, aren't you getting ready to go on vacation? Yes, and I am so excited. Yeah. So where are you going this time? <laughs> Africa. Africa? Oh, why Africa? Girl, you're going to make a mistake and waste all of your money. Huh? I heard that when people go to Africa, they don't even come back right. It's like they get some bad juju. Not to mention. It's so much sickness mm. and poverty there. Yeah. Only thing I can see is those kids with those big bellies Ugh. and flies all around their mouth. I don't believe what I'm hearing. Girl, don't waste your money when you can go to Paris or London. And if you're that desperate for a vacation, why don't you go to the Dominican Republic or the Bahamas? Those are cheap vacations. Don't forget this. Mm -hmm. Those people in Africa, they don't like us. That's right. Remember, they sold us into slavery. That's right. Well, nobody alive that I know sold anybody into slavery. Mm. Besides, Africa is a continent with over 50 countries. They all the same to me. Nasty and sleazy and scheming. Y'all heard about that scam that came out of Africa? So many, which one? Right. Don't you know how blessed you are to be in America? Now you want to go back to them, excuse my French, poop hole country. All those diseases came from Africa. The Asian bird flu, mm -hmm. the mad cow disease. Mm -hmm. Even now, the coronavirus. What happens if you get sick? Okay, <laughs> okay, okay. Right. I'm done with y'all. Palpatina, poop hole countries, That's really? Right. Yeah. As much as you talk about the man, you're starting to sound just like him. And Gladys, <laughs> the Asian bird flu did not come out of Africa, and neither did the coronavirus. You know, y'all are really starting to sound ignorant. Ignorant? What's she talking about? There are so many beautiful beaches and landscapes in Africa. Some of the smartest and most innovative people come from Africa. Some of the food we love to eat comes from Africa. Albertina, the black eyed peas you like to eat, it comes from Africa. And the cocoa you use in your chocolate comes from Ghana. And Miss Gladys, yes. the coffee you say is so addictive, yes. comes from Ethiopia. Now, I'm not saying Africa is all perfect and everything, but the same issues they have over there, we have over here in America. They just hide it from us. That's good and all, but why do some of the Africans that I know, they stink? You know what? <laughs> I wasn't even going to say anything. But do you realize the older you get, you're not the best smelling person yourself? Wait a minute. You saying that I stink? Yes, I am. Yeah, I've been intending to say something to you about that. Glad you saying that I stink too? <laughs> well, stink is a strong word. Oh. Mel odorous might be better. It's my hormones. And y'all know I'm still sweating at the hot Honey, night. that is not sweat. Trust me, it is not sweat. <laughs> no. Well, you know, last week I went to get my colon cleaned that out. Didn't, that didn't work. <laughs> Look at her with the mask. That's what you keep talking about, people. The very things that you all are saying here is what we learned. We didn't learn about the, the beauty and diversity in Africa. All Africans are not the same. They don't speak the same language. They don't have the same customs. They don't wear the same clothes. Again, Africa is a continent, not a country. Is it poverty there? Yes. Is it sickness there? Yes. Is there corruption there? Yes. But so is it right here in America. There is so much beauty and history in Africa that I will never see or learn in America. Why? Because there are people like you that are like black supremacists. Black, black supremacists? Yes. Always looking down on the black and brown people all over the world. That is classism and it is worse. Now. I'm going to Africa because I'm not going to let people like you shape how I think. Well, I don't care. I'm still not going to no Africans. And I'm not going to Africa either. I'm going to stay right here in America. That's right, Albertina. You need to go with me to Africa because you need some of that juju to get rid of that funk you got going on. Albertina, that is a good idea. You really do need to go get rid of some of that stink stink. <laughs> and that's your girl talking. <laughs>